基本上，人类罹患的疾病当中，呃，有很大的部分其实是跟基因本身。它的组成是有关系的。那有一些是先天性，它基因发生变异，然后一出生下来就会发生病症的。但是有更多的是只是因为基因的变异而造成了呃它罹患这个疾病的几率问题。那当然这个问题很复杂。那这个问题牵涉到人种、性别等等的。Can genetic analysis help predict and preempt illnesses before they arise? 如果我们可以针对呃它的基因做一个筛检，然后试图去看它是否带有某一个特定基因罹患的这个高比率，那我们可以事先做一些预防。MMA fighter Keller knows how to handle his opponents, but he is aware that the most deadly opponent is the one you can't see. 我现在就是教一些太极跟气功，那因为你一直在运动，那你自然就会知道。身体健康是很重要的。我第一次听到基因检测，当然觉得是，这就好像可以很明显告诉你的弱点在哪里，那你可以去补强。Keller hopes that a genetic analysis will reveal his hidden nemesis and give him an edge in the fight. He decides to see if genetic testing will help. 基因会应该会遗传嘛？因为像我我的爷爷他有得过类似喉癌，都可以从基因检测带出来之后，他有疾病风险，他并不表示说一定会罹患这样子的疾病。那当然，他还受到很多的相关的因素的影响，包含了饮食啊、生活习惯啊，其实这些都会去影响我们基因的表现跟疾病啊得到的一些风险。是希望说真的可以做到提早预测、提早预防。In 1953, Watson and Crick confirmed DNA's double helix structure. Fifty years later, the U.S. Human Genome Project announced that it had successfully mapped the entire human genome and stored the gene sequence in a database. The National Institutes of Health in the U.S. then launched a program challenging scientists worldwide to create an affordable human gene sequencer. Today's genetic testing chips are the practical application of these decades-long programs of R&D. 像晶片这个东西，在呃欧美很多生技公司，他们早期已经大量的投入了。其实晶片的运用还是都是以学术的一个需求为主啦。哈，那如果说我们要把它用在个人消费市场的话，我想这个种族的适用性是非常重要的一个点。G1 晶片呢，它一次可以检测将近六十种的疾病。那这些疾病单，大概就是我们亚洲华人这边比较常听到的一些慢性病哈，甚至像呃现在癌症方面的，我们其实。是在 G1 晶片里面都有含跨，晶片上我们都有每一个这个基因的探针，它可以去帮我们把你的 DNA 做一个所谓的基因分析。来，这是您的基因裁剪盒。我们是用 After removing the sample gathering kit from its box, the lab technician first takes out the sample swab. The technicians must be careful not to contaminate the swab. Then the swab is placed inside the test subject's mouth and lightly brushed back and forth and up and down in order to ensure that the swab accumulates a sufficient concentration of cells from the mucous membranes of the mouth. After the sample is gathered, the swab tip is detached and placed in a test tube containing fluid to preserve the cells. That completes the sample gathering procedure. 基因筛检基本上是一个呃专业的技术，因为它包含了两个重要的这个实验，一个是所谓的生物检查的部分，另外一个是基因体资料库的建立。那有了这个资料库的建立之后，我们利用所谓我们的采样，然后对它的简体做这个基因的分析，然后再去跟资料库做比对，才能知道它的基因是跟资料库里面的差异性在哪里。进而去对应到某一个特定的疾病的发生率。可能很多人他会觉得说，哦，我都不要知道。可是老实说，你都不知道，你反而会疏于去预防。我会想要透过这种方式，比较早一点知道自己到底需要去预防什么，避免它去发生。Luckily, 
Tyler doesn't have long to wait. Today's DNA testing techniques are highly developed, and within seven days, he will receive his individual DNA test report. He will soon know whether his worries about hereditary diseases are justified. With the completion of the Human Genome Project and the subsequent boom in health and medical applications, DNA testing has provided the keys to solving the riddles of our health. Seven days after his DNA sample is collected, Keller returns to the testing center. Over the past seven days, the specialist analyzed Keller's sample using the latest lab instruments. The results of the report are in. Keller's fat metabolism is especially slow. And if he wants to control his weight, he needs to be extra careful about his fat intake. The results also reveal an unexpected concern. DNA testing has revealed that Keller has MICA genes, a white blood cell antigen gene. In Asians, this type of gene increases the probability of liver cirrhosis or liver cancer. Interestingly, the same gene has no effect in Caucasians. 心情还蛮复杂的你可能不能控制你的基因the genetic screening result is linked to a database of nutrients needed by each specific genotype. The healthcare provider can then create a personalized health formula based on the genotype of the individual. By combining the photo and messaging capabilities of a smartphone, Keller just needs to take a photo of a menu or food item and send it to the nutritionist. The nutritionist can provide a real-time consultation for Keller. Back in the gym, Keller continues training. DNA testing has not only unveiled his body's secrets, it has also increased his motivation to pursue a healthy lifestyle. 現在逐漸走向一個所謂的個人化的醫療跟健康的管理,將來的理想是我們希望能夠將每一個人的基因體定序出來,然後再去對應我們的資料庫,了解他可能罹患的疾病,去對他做一個特定性的健康的管理,